News 8 is putting you first tonight. There is, as you've noticed, quite a chill in the air, meaning flu season is fast approaching. We have a health expert in studio tonight with some important information about the flu vaccine and getting your flu shot. She joins Maureen right now. Maureen. All right. Thanks, Adam. Joining me is Kathy Root from the Livingston County Health Department. Kathy, there are different kinds of flu shots, flu vaccines. What are we talking about here? There's a common flu shot, which can be given to anyone over six months of age. There's a nasal flu spray, which can be given to people between the ages of two and 49. And there's also a high dose flu vaccine for the elderly, which is given to people over 65. We're going to talk about the flu, vac or the flu spray in a later segment, but for purposes of the elderly here, when we're talking about a, a special dosage, um, at what point do they get this and who is it really for? It's for anyone over the age of 65. It has a higher amount of antigen in the flu vaccine, so it helps uh, boost their immune response because typically as we age, our immune response decreases. So typically would a doctor suggest to somebody age 65 and older that they get this? Yes. It's sort of an automatic thing. Yes, if it's available, yes. All right, so we're talking the shot, the, the, uh, the and, and everybody should get these, right? Now is the time. Now is the time. The CDC recommends everyone get the flu shot or a flu vaccine by the end of October. And how long is the season? It seems like we were just talking about the flu. <laughs> it never really ends, does it? <laughs> no, uh, really flu can occur year round. Uh, typically the flu season runs from October till May. All right, so now is the time. Uh, if you have any questions, people can always contact their local health departments. Obviously their doctors, your local pharmacy. A lot Absolutely. of people available to help. All right, thank you, Kathy. Okay. And uh, we'll send it back to Adam. All right, Maureen, thank you so much. We have Stacey.